So in this question, we're asked to display the data on a stem and leaf. Now, what I would always recommend with a stem and leaf is that you do it unordered first. So that means you just put the data on and then we do it a second time where the data is what's called ordered. Otherwise, you're fiddling around trying to see which is the next one consecutively. So let's just have a quick browse. We have one, two, one, three, one, two, one, four. So it looks like the first two digits going back to, it looks like one, two is the lowest and up to one, five. So just in case we've missed them, we go one, one to one, six, but it looks like one, two to one, five, one, 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 two, one, three, one, four, one, five. We put one, six on if we need it. So starting with the one, three, nine, we just go our, work our way across one, three, nine, one three one one three six one four one one two one one two six one two one one three one one three one one four five one four three one four one one three zero and one five zero so on the next one you can see this is my unordered so a quick bit of rough work will save us so much time so we can say 12, 13, 14, and 15 are the ones that we need. If we order 12, we have a 1, a 1, and a 6. If we order 13, 0, 3 ones, 0, 1, 2, 3, and then we have a 6 and a 9. And order 14, we have a 1, a 1, a 3, and a 5. And 15 is just the zero. On every stem and leaf, you have to write down the key. So my key is 112 slash 1 equals 121. You can pick any of the numbers. You will lose marks if you're asked to draw a stem and leaf and you don't do the key. So find the lower quartile and the upper quartile of the data for the set. So let's see how many points we have. We have, if we just take these nine here, we've nine and we have another five. So we have 14. So n is equal to 14. So in 14, it's an even number. So if I just, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have seven. So there's my seven. Just a quick sketch will help you. So my median, we're not including seven and eight. So I gotta get the median of eight numbers. The median of, sorry, seven numbers which is going to be the fourth one. So I need the fourth number. And if I count up three from the bottom, it's the same number. So one, two, three, four. So 130, Q1. Let's start at the bottom and go backwards. One, two, three, and it has to be the fourth one. One, four, one. One, four, one. So the interquartile range is going to be 10, as you can see, right down where you're getting it from. Circle 130 and route 131, just 130, 130, so 11, not 10, 11. Be careful. Percentage of values lie between the upper quartile and lower quartile. So we circle between lower and upper. We've got this one. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So eight out of 14, which is four over seven, which is just over 57%, 57, 57.14. I'll leave that two decimals. We're not asked to round. And then the interquartile range, which we have from earlier is 11.